This morning is starting off mild with those temperatures still in the mid to upper 50s across much of the area. And we still have some clouds going on. Thankfully, no precipitation. If we take a look here at the Ward weather camera, mostly cloudy skies. Now, every now and then the sunshine is peeking out of these uh, clouds, and that is uh, pretty good. But we are starting to see some changes into our area. Now, uh, first to set the stage here, obviously, as I mentioned, temperatures still in the mid to upper 50s. Wellsville has been at 60 degrees all morning long, so that is really a bit a warm temperature there. We actually already hit our high temperature of about 61 degrees after midnight. Temperatures are going to kind of uh, cool off uh, for uh, the sort of the rest of the afternoon. Now there are some breaks in the clouds as I mentioned and I think by this afternoon we'll see a few more of those around. Uh, look, uh, we do have the cold front pushing right through the valley right now so that is going to bring uh, some cooler air by the end of the day. The future tracker kind of shows this. By 4 o'clock some upper 40s out there. Some low 50s still partly to mostly cloudy skies so cooling off and then especially overnight, partly to mostly cloudy skies. Those temperatures in the mid to upper 30s, so it's definitely going to be colder tomorrow morning than it was this morning. As far as your forecast tomorrow, around 50 degrees there for a high in the afternoon, and that is key. I have a chance of some showers here early on. Watch these temperatures as we progress towards about midnight uh, for uh, early Thursday up to about 60 degrees, so that a cold front sweeping through our area actually is going to return as a warm front and bring us warmer temperatures overnight into early Thursday morning. Rain, uh, st rain showers staying likely for the first half of Thursday. And then once again, that front moves back through our area with those temperatures dropping into the mid to upper 40s by the end of the day. Now, given the complicated nature of these temperatures, I wanted to sort of break it down on just showing the temperature map alone and not having the clouds and precipitation on there. So starting off, we'll cool off a little bit by this afternoon, upper 40s, low 50s. Tonight is going to be one of the colder nights this week as temperatures drop off into the mid to upper 30s. So you will need a jacket as you head out tomorrow morning. Now, by the afternoon, tomorrow still. Still uh, kind of in the upper 40s, low 50s, but it's by tomorrow, uh, late tomorrow evening into early Thursday where those temperatures warm back up to about 60 degrees. So a Thursday will probably be another day where we reach our high temperature uh, just after midnight. And then as we progress later on Thursday, 6 o'clock, you can already see the colder temperatures starting to come back. And then we'll see mid to upper 40s by the end of the day on Thursday. So a lot of temperature swings showing up here in early November. A 56 degrees today, cooling off into uh, to about 50 degrees by sunset. No chance of precipitation. Northwest wind gusting over 15 miles per hour at certain points in time. Could make it feel chilly. Seven day outlook. Afternoon showers tomorrow. Remember, temperature will warm up to about 60 uh, late tomorrow night into early Thursday. Then the rains likely Wednesday night into early Thursday and temperature drops back down into the 40s after a warm start to the day on Thursday. Friday around 50, staying around 50 degrees over the weekend and into the early part of the new week with some partly cloudy skies.